Okay, I need to do some touch up on a ceiling. And I usually keep my paint in a little can, but uh, this time I did not have time for that. I just wanted to show you what works good sometimes. The intention is you can take the lid. And just use the lid and fill this little deal here. It's like a little reservoir. I just kind of keep dipping. I don't like to dip my brush too deep, especially when doing ceilings, as it'll have a tendency to drip on you through from the handle. But basically, I'm just swiping the brush into here create in a little reservoir and then I can take this where I need to go you see and paint things up like that up there so now I can get one final dip and then I can hold my deal down here as a shield and keep painting from that that way I don't have to keep dipping down into the main bucket and then by being below this, if anything drips or falls, in theory it can just fall onto my lid that I'm holding here. And by being able to dip in often, it just means I'm getting enough paint up there to get the job done. Generally, works out nice and easy. This one's right below where the fan is, so I'll be able to turn the fan on and just verify that you know, it does coat like we want it to. I'll go ahead and turn that fan on. That'll dry it out even quicker and it'll be done deal. But that's my quick tip for paint and sealants, touch up paint and sealants. Nice, easy, custom way. Yeah, I should mention I threw a piece of cardboard down too to catch anything in case anything went rogue. Okay, it's been bidding good. Once the job's done, you can just return the bucket. Back to its home. Yeah, it's a done deal. All set there. Finished. Ooh. Mm -hmm.